This is Music Theory Minute, a weekly series diving into different aspects of a monthly topic. This month we're talking about structuring a melody. Last time we talked about how certain notes in a key feel resolved and certain notes don't. Composers use this to their advantage to give their melodies a satisfying flow. Take a look at the Super Mario Bros. 3 overworld theme. This four-bar phrase ends on the second note of the key, which feels naturally unresolved. Afterwards, we repeat the same phrase, but change the ending so that it lands on our tonic note, which feels very resolved. Did you notice how the first phrase set you up for more music, whereas the second phrase felt complete? This kind of melodic structure is called antecedent consequent period, which sounds very flashy. I think of it like a musical question and answer. Building off of this idea, you can construct longer melodies by... Oops, that's for next time. That was Music Theory Minute. Bye. <laughs>